Hi, what I really liked about the workshop is it gave us a way to identify where our company has been wasting time and money, and then also a way to fix the problem, which is something that I think we all knew we had the problem, but we had no idea how to fix it. My name is Jan Rice with MichiganMall.com, and the high points was I was very, very intrigued about how much we waste and to learn the itty, itty bitty things that add up. Yes. What were some of the ways you found? Time. Um, <laughs> repeat. Repeats. Repeats. I think that repeats is a big one. You want to know a break? One of my biggest gripes? Yes, I do. <laughs> it's common courtesy of returning phone calls. To me, I don't understand. You know, we return phone calls constantly. If yes. somebody calls up, they're going to get a call back. Yes. If we call people, they say, your phone call is important to me, and then we never hear back. <laughs> it's very easy to pick up the phone and say, thanks for your phone call, but we're oh, really not interested right now, but I really appreciate you. I mean, it's common yes. courtesy. That's, You're right. That's my yes, brain. <laughs> that's my brain. Hi, uh, my name is Preston Blevins, and uh, I live in Southern California. And I had the pleasure of attending a uh, really well thought out workshop that had a lot of value. Um, the workshop title really dealt with eliminating waste, and it had its focus in on administrative processes. Uh, and really, uh, even though I had intellectually understood the administrative processes to be quite wasteful, the workshop helped me understand what was the depth of waste and also some very simple, doable, implementable processes uh, that just about anybody could put in place. And uh, I personally feel that I was very wisely spent two hours, over two hours. And I, I know because uh, I was monitoring the session and all the attendees gave uh, the uh, workshop leader a very high points. The information that was presented today helped clarify a number of things that, yes, I knew but haven't been doing. And that's, I think the, the big thing as a small business owner, uh, we need to be very aware of how we could be introducing waste into our own organizations and the steps that we can take to, to remove that waste or not build it in in the first place. So it's really back down to practicing what you know. I found the seminar today very productive with Mr. Ron Crabtree. All the information was extremely well organized, had a logical sequence, and I'm very thankful for how it will impact my business as I implement the ideas of making sure I get people in my team to take care of the things that I have no business doing. It was, it was a great uh, use of my time, and I'm very thankful to have been invited to attend. Jacqueline De La Fuente, and I'm with Spirit Trust. Cool. So what have you learned so far? What's kind of the big high point? Um, basically, a high point would be um, to better my company. Uh, we do have a lot of waste to, um, to get more control under. So. Yeah, what type of waste are you seeing? Yeah. Uh, lack of communication and uh, personnel missing <laughs> okay. is a big thing for our company. So. Great. So do you have any idea yet what you might do with the information you've learned? Um, or you still need more info? Well, we still have a couple more hours here. Um, I'll take that, uh, obviously, in a lot of consideration and helpfulness. Uh, take it back to my office, and I have a few more people on my team that will help me out and uh, get this distributed to the right people. And uh, we should be able to get this um, underway and get our company under control. And it should be very successful. Great. Thanks so much. Thanks.